Hey guys, it's Dave from Golf Ed. In the e-blast we sent out earlier this week, I told you that I would send more thoughts about the Ryder Cup in addition to the article that I wrote for it. And here we go. What can we learn from what happened today at the Ryder Cup? Well, a lot of things. One, playing in Europe is not easy. You got the whole European fan there. It's loud. It's a different kind of environment than what you're used to. And staying in the shot is very important. But on top of that, a lot of the U.S. players hadn't played competitive round of golf in five or six weeks. So the guys in Europe have played this course a lot. The Italian Open is here. So they had the home course advantage, and they're mentally sharp from being in competition all the time. How does that relate to us? Well, I'll tell you. If you're playing in your club championship or a match against guys you haven't played against or there's a lot of trash being talked, you have to set yourself up for success by trying to play in that environment more often. Don't give yourself five foot putts. Don't fluff it up in the rough. Play the shot as it lies and put everything out. That's gonna help you stay mentally sharp so when you're playing in a match that really counts, you can perform the way you want to. And that's not to say these guys haven't played tons of events and know how to play competitively, but being sharp and being in a competitive environment more often it does have an advantage. I think the U.S. team looked way more engaged in the afternoon matches today. And I'm hopeful that the rest of the weekend, they will stay that way. And it will come down to the final matches on Sunday. I'm anxious to hear what you guys think. Hope that educates your game. I'll talk to you soon.